Hey guys, welcome back to the medical education video series. And I believe this is number five. I've already lost track, but this time we're going to talk about screen capturing and uh, basically how to do what I'm doing. Now, the product that I'm using for this particular type of screen casting or screen capturing is a product called Camtasia. Now, if you look at the screen right here in front of you, you'll see Camtasia uh, on the monitor. Now, the nice thing about Camtasia is it's very, very simple. I'm a very simple person and therefore I need very simple software. This is by no means the only way to capture audio and video at the same time. You can use uh, QuickTime, there's multiple, multiple other programs, and I'm only going to talk about Camtasia. I have no stock in Camtasia. In fact, if my portfolio continues the way it has been um, continuing over the past couple of years, I'll be working till I'm 95. So I have no stock in Camtasia, but I think it's uh, one of the better products and it's what I use. Now Camtasia is very, very easy to use. What I'm going to show you on the first screen is what happens when you open Camtasia. So I'm going to open Camtasia. Camtasia is about $100, I believe. And the nice thing is you can get it from the App Store. You can download it right to your computer, open it, and start using it. And for some reason, um, it, in fact, it's so easy to use, I can't even open it. No, but normally it's very easy to use. What you see right in front of you is the screen that you're capturing your computer with. So essentially what you do is you open up Camtasia. It's going to look a little bit something like what you're looking at right now. What you see in the middle of the screen is essentially your desktop. So you can set it up to record um, YouTube high definition type of videos, iPod. You basically pick the screen size that you want and it's Basically, it walks you through it the minute that you open up the program. You don't have to open up any book on how to do this. You just open up Camtasia and, and start recording. Now, for this particular uh, video, I'm using a MacBook Air, which is my newer laptop. It's got a built-in camera. Um, you will need a camera, obviously, for this. And what you see right in front of you is you, basically your computer. This is not my computer, but it's a, a computer where you're going to have all of your desktop icons, and it's going to look just like this. So if you wanted to record voice over a PowerPoint, for example. You would simply open up Camtasia, you would have the PowerPoint on your screen, and then you click through your PowerPoint or your keynote or whatever it is, and record your audio over that. Now what Camtasia does is it captures everything that's on the screen that you preset, and the audio that you're streaming, in this case I'm streaming in through this microphone here, and it turns it into a video file. And so what you would basically do is go up to one of these icons up here somewhere and uh, hit export. And you can export it as different movie files. And so then when you're ready to put your entire product together, you um, edit it. If you look at the bottom of the screen here, you can put in music, you can put in uh, different types of um, color images, you can put in a ton of things, and all you have to do is just click and drag it in to the screen. Now the nice thing about this is you can be very creative with it. When you finish your product, you finish your video, say you've got eight minutes on how to read Wellens Waves uh, or some other cardiology topic, you've got your little video set up. In the screen, and I'm circling right here, you can set up where you want your face to be. Now if you have a face like this, perhaps you don't want your face to be seen. But if you do want your face to be seen, what's going to happen is your face will pop up here as you're recording, and then you can move it around the screen in different areas. You can make it big, you can make it small. And then so the person who's watching your final product can watch your slides or website. You don't have to use slides. You can use a program, you can tour a website, you can do anything you want. They're going to see your face, hear the audio, and see the thing that you're talking about. Very, very easy to do when you're finished. You simply export as a movie file uh, or any other type of file that you want to set up, and then boom, you're done. That's it. That's how you screen capture, screencast video with a product called Camtasia. So it's very, very easy. You simply download it from the App Store, put it right on your computer, open it, and you're going to see a screen that looks like this. You can put in words. You can put in uh, little figures. It's very, very intuitive and it works incredibly easy. It's very easy to use. So that is Camtasia. Again, this is for the Mac. Uh, there's also a PC version as well, obviously. But uh, it's very, very easy to use. You can get very creative with it and do all kinds of stuff that uh, you're going to see on this medical education video series. Again, this is only one way to do it. There's multiple other great ways to do it. There's many other products, and I hope that we get through some of those products here on the Medical Education Video Series. So this is Medical Education Video Series number five. We'll see you back next time for number six. Bye for now.